Hey guys, Monica here from Feed Me Hot. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a healthier version of a classic Thanksgiving dish, stuffing. I used a friend's recipe who was also a chef in Miami and healthified it. But more on that later. Let's get cooking. You're going to need the following ingredients. One cup diced white onion, one cup diced turnip, one cup diced carrots, one cup diced celery, one cup diced brown mushrooms, a third cup minced garlic, one cup fresh cranberries, half a cup craisins, half a cup chopped walnuts, two eggs, one tablespoon minced thyme, one tablespoon minced sage, half a tablespoon of minced rosemary, half a loaf chopped Ezekiel bread, one cup organic chicken stock, a third cup pure olive oil. Begin by preheating the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. In a large skillet, pour the olive oil and preheat to medium over high heat. Add the onions, mix well with the olive oil, then add the turnips, mixing well. Finally, add the carrots and saute all together for about five minutes. Add the celery, saute for another one to two minutes. Next, add the mushrooms, garlic, spices, and cook for another five minutes, stirring occasionally. Turn the heat to low. Add the cranberries, craisins, and walnuts. Cook for about five to eight minutes over very low heat. Add the diced bread and chicken stock. Turn the heat up and bring it to a boil, then remove from the heat immediately. In a separate bowl, whisk both eggs until they become frothy. Slowly begin adding the bread mixture into the eggs and mixing well until all of the stuffing has been added into the bowl. Take a 13 by 9 glass baking dish and coat it with cooking spray, preferably olive or coconut oil. Then transfer the stuffing into the glass. And bake for about 30 minutes. By keeping the recipe tasty but still waistline friendly, I replaced white bread with Ezekiel bread, which is minimally processed, pre-spreaded grains, higher in fiber and higher in protein. Instead of using a classic chicken stock, I used an organic one, which is MSG free and also lower in sodium. And instead of using butter, I used pure olive oil, which contains no cholesterol, is lower in saturated fats, and is a plant-based fat. So while your friends this Thanksgiving with this great dish, and stay tuned for other holiday recipes. As always, feeding you health.